everybody and welcome once again to We Roll Dice. My name is Stu and today we are doing an unboxing of the Beastmen Centigors. This on the box it says Beastmen Centigor Heroes. Now this is a web store exclusive. They are a fine cast or a resin model and they're from GW coming in at about $76 Canadian for five Centigors. Now, what uh, exactly did you get in the box? Let's take a look. This is an older model, but they still have not updated them. So, here in the box, you'll see, you can already see, it comes with the old rectangular squares. All right, let's open her up and take a quick look. Okay, so, we have, these are right arms with the spears. Those spears are actually fairly straight for being resin or fine cast, if you will. There we go. Now, the bodies come in two parts. So you have the left half, which includes the buckler, the body up to the head, nice fine detail on them. And you can see it even takes the body all the way around. And then the spears attach on that side and this section goes right on there. You can see it has this long piece here that fits into these slot of bases. Now, I won't be using these bases. I'm going to use the small oval bases um, just because I've sw switched all my fantasy over to the Age of Sigmar, which are like round or oval bases. So let's see here, you get uh, that. And I believe this is the exact same. Yes, okay, so you get Two of the sprues with the left and two of the sprues with the rights, both the exact same. And then two sprues of the arms with the spears. And you get a standard, an instrument, and the long weapon here, which I believe is for the hero. Or possibly the musician. No, because that all goes on that arm. So when you have a musician, you want to have a spear in his hand. The banner is also has a spear. And then this nice big glaive. You can see it's got the nice skull hanging from it. They are very nice detailed. And uh, this kit, not a whole lot of warpage. You can see just a tiny little bit there, but not a lot. And then this is the champion itself. Let's clear this out of the way so you can see. This would be like the uh, main hero or, or whatnot in the group. The, the one champion that you usually have. Actually, I don't even know if the beastmen have that. But this is the different sculpt. So you can see it's the same thing. It's just a two-piece with the third piece being the arm. Really simple models to put together. So you should have a really, really easy go at it. Now I'm just going to grab my cards here. Or maybe I'm not. But you can see, I was going to grab my, my rules for them here, but I don't have that quite available with me. Um, you can see it, it's, it's a really, really simple, bit, simple build. Uh, $76 price range, I think, is really, really steep for what you get here. Now it is a web store exclusive. You can only purchase it online from Games Workshop. Save maybe a few stores might keep them in stock. But uh, I for the $76, I mean, I'm curious how they perform on the field. Now I was lucky enough to get these for a present. Uh, so there's that, but just not sure. Not sure if I would end up uh, paying that full price if it, if it was me. Um, I think I'd look to try and pick them up on the used market, but again, they are wonderfully detailed. And even for being resin, they're good, they're sturdy. Um, you can see that spear there has a little bit of warping to it. But again, you can just get yourself some hot water, place them in the hot water, Manipulate it, they'll get softer. Manipulate it so it's nice and straight and then have yourself a bowl of cold water or two sinks, whatever, and then dip it into the cold water and it kind of shocks it and sets it into the new 
new position. Anyways, not uh, not too much on this video. Just wanted to give a quick uh, a quick look at those. And once again, these are the bases that you get. Not happy with them. I'm gonna go with the oval bases. But uh, until I get this all done, guys, you know, just uh, have fun with it.